Here we go. I'm making this video for Butter Gallery. My summers in Ontario are far reaching. I'm starting us here at my Bose Cottage in Port Severn. It's a beautiful lake scene with recreational boating. The kids can have fun. We can recharge before we have to work hard on the canoe trip. I love seeing the boat houses. I love watching the kids get up on the water skis and wakeboard. They try really hard. The annual canoe trip. I've been going on these things since I was a kid. My dad used to organize them with a bunch of the neighbors. Now my friend Deacon and I take turns planning the trips. Trip planning is daunting, especially for eight people, food and all, but it's worth it. You can literally watch these four kids grow up in a week on these canoe trips, every day paddling, breaking camp, making camp. I brought my paint box this year on our trip. What a joy to do plain air on the French River. The rapids are a new thing for us as a family. A learning curve for sure. Lots of fun. The boys loved it. I sure did too. I painted five 48 by 60 oil on canvas paintings in the studio off some of my plein airs I did on the trip. Here for Butter Gallery, I've given them five eight and a half by 11 wood panels that I did on site. Fresh paint. Little Pine Rapids was one of the biggest rapids our group did. This painting is in response to one of those moments after a long portage when you come out of the woods after you throw all your stuff on the ground and you see your kids there snacking out, just sitting in a canoe waiting for you to get everything together. It's a time where they really can be kids, catching snakes and frogs and having a good time in all these marshes. This 48 by 60 is from Algonquin. The Cardinal Flower, I love you. We see this flower every August, whether we're in Algonquin, Killarney or the French River. It's tall, slender, delicate, and bold all at the same time. This is a plain air piece I did of one, and every year since its discovery in my life, I've been painting it every summer. Thank you, Deacon. To the memory of Tom Thompson, artist, woodsman, and guide, who was drowned in Canoe Lake July 8, 1917. He lived humbly but passionately with the wild. It made him brother to all untamed things of nature. It drew him apart and revealed itself wonderfully to him. It sent him out from the woods only to show these revelations through his art, and it took him to itself at last. What is plein air without trying to do a sunset now and then? The race with light. After the tent is set up, I pull out my paint box. Yes, that's right. I brought two mussel shells from Maine for my oil and turp. As the days go by, we switch partners in canoes. Depending on the efficiency of the cruise, depends on how many times we have to stop and how long we have for lunch. If we're waiting, that means I get to pull out my easel. If I don't have enough time, I'll just pull out the sketchbook and do line drawings. This year I drew tons of canoes. They're so much easier in real life to trace that line. Getting to paint the northern Ontario lakes again is a dream come true. I'm so thankful.